Destiny claimed to be unlike anything which has ever come before. They claim not to be a religion. They claim not to be political. They claim so many, many things. However, they base many of their ideas upon faith. Blind faith that Bernard is right, that Sonnet is correct, and that their views and words are the truth. And their leader, Bernard Pullman, as well as Sonnet's spies, cannot be wrong. Especially Bernard, because it's claimed that Bernard has reached a level of pure self-honesty, self-awareness, and is a perfected individual in terms of the conscious. It's even claimed that Bernard went into the dimensions, met Hitler, brought him through to forgive himself for the criminality of World War II and the Holocaust, and used that knowledge, that ability to cure Hitler of his, well, self-deception, his self-fear, and to forgive himself, he used that as a key to delete heaven. But it doesn't end there. They believe that reptilians created this reality as a reality matrix. They believe that if you're not seeing the proof of destiny, it's because, well, of course, you're within a reality matrix. As a result, everything you see, all that you experience, is within a false reality. The result is that you cannot see reality as it is because you're manifesting your reality in a construct generated originally by reptilians. They believe in all sorts of conspiracy theories which once again cannot be proven. They believe that Sunet spies used to portal, which is another word for channel, that they used to channel these beings in a form of trance. And so on and so forth. How are they not like a religion? How are they any different than any other religion or cult which bases itself upon blind faith? Destiny is not anything new. Its ideas are borrowed or just simply stolen. It's not a revelation. It's not a new phase or a step into a new world or the thing which will save the world from itself. It's a ridiculous belief which is not grounded within reality. If it was more grounded, if it was more realistic and more open, perhaps it would be for the good of mankind. But with central figures running the show, with the beliefs of Bernard Pullman at the centre of everything, and with the call for donations, how can we take destiny seriously? <laughs>